still feel super embarrassed because I have like OnlyFans and things like that. But the thing is, if my son wasn't autistic, I feel like my life would have been so different. Yeah. So I feel like as a woman, sometimes we have to use our body to make money. Unfortunately, it's fucked up. We live in a fucked up society, but men rule this world. And I feel like sometimes you have sex cells. Sorry. What we have here is once again, women pass out blame for their actions onto somebody else. And who's the lucky winner this time? Well, it's her autistic son. And just for good measure, we'll throw on the ambiguous men bad and are still ruling the world. And my only question is, if your son is such a handicap in your life that you need to sell pictures of your butthole, then why not give more custody to the father? But we know why she won't, because the father is most likely not around. And now uses this kid to drum up sympathy from people for her poor actions. And judging by the way she dressed for this podcast, it looks like she was already in the lifestyle way before any kid was around. But women like this who have bad decision compounding after bad decision will blame the nearest man for her decisions. And if he's not around or one has never been around long enough, she'll then start shuffling around all the blame to her children or patriarchy, anything else but her, so she can still maintain her virtuous status and appear to everybody else like all this bad stuff is just happening to her. When all along she's been part of the problem, you won't see men throwing their kids under the bus or blaming ambiguous things because they know they had a hand in where they are. Because unlike women, men want to fix it. Women like this don't really want to fix their situation because now they get to go on podcasts and get attention and talk about how down bad they are. Where if she was just some normal mom trying to make ends meet, no one would be talking to her. But because she's a mom who sells pictures of her butthole with an autistic son, well, we better give her a Netflix special. What these podcasts are, are really just give me attention shows with generic down bad story or people using their autistic children as ornaments to just look a bit more fancier than the next person in line. And there's nothing too low that these people won't do for an ounce of attention. 